for Superstato. For Ukraine, these are being touted as a game changer. Four M142 high mobility artillery rocket systems or HIMARS being fired in unison, launching a salvo of guided rockets toward Russian positions. America is believed to have supplied 16 of these so far, their GPS guided rockets able to hit targets more than 50 miles away. For the Russians, particularly their logistic chains, the results have been devastating. This was a Russian train carrying troops and supplies to the southern city of Kherson after a HIMARS strike. Ukrainian officials claim 80 soldiers were killed and 200 wounded. This switch to a deep battle tactic has helped Kyiv degrade Russia's ability to fight, disrupting its supplies of fuel and ammunition and destroying its command posts, and in the south, helping Ukraine retake territory. What it's done is it's just made it harder for the Russians to do business. They're already overstretched. This is a real problem for them. And um, in that, these weapons are far beyond a tactical effect. This is strategic. This can shift, it imposes such a burden on the Russians that it, it shifts the, their ability to, to sustain operations, to launch operations. Um, it may even influence strategic decisions to just give up areas that they can't secure. So yes, I think that these things are strategically important. The Pentagon says Ukraine's used HIMARS to destroy 100 Russian targets, among them weapons caches, air defence positions and long-range artillery. Alongside HIMARS, Ukraine's also using M270 multiple launch rocket systems, or MLRS, to hit Russian positions. First used in the Gulf War, it carries the same launcher pod as HIMARS, but can fire 12 rockets rather than six. Together, Britain and Norway have donated around a dozen of these. These things will be wasted attacking frontline positions. They're devastating, but they can achieve so much more hitting behind the immediate combat zone. Um, if the Russians are going to rush a tank column down a road to relieve an attack position, well, we know where that road is and we've got its GPS coordinates. Um, and I think you're going to see that sort of, of application because the, the Ukrainians are fighting smart. Ukrainian officials say they need 100 HIMARS systems and more ammunition. Washington has approved further shipments, but much to Kyiv's frustration, only on condition they're not used against targets actually inside Russia. For Ukraine, retaking Kherson would be a major victory, but with its forces having to ration the number of rockets it uses, success may well depend on its own supply lines. Simon Newton, Forces News. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.